Hi, my name is Henry Sagerman. This is the 30 cell puzzle. This is joint work with Saul Schleimer. So there are five identical pieces. Each one has uh, this shape. There's these sort of uh, six kind of curvy dodecahedra, so they curve around in, in this arc. So what's the puzzle? The puzzle is to um, combine them together to give uh, an object that holds together uh, on its own with no glue or sticky tape or anything like that. Um, and this is the solution of the puzzle. You get this uh, interesting ring uh, object made out of dodecahedra. So at the end of the video I'll show you uh, the solution to the reverse puzzle, which is turning this thing into these five pieces. Uh, but first let me uh, tell you where it, where it comes from. So uh, this is related to the uh, 120 cell, which is a four-dimensional polytope uh, which has 120 dodecahedral faces, so this is the half-120 cell. Um, and so that's, that's where the name comes from. There are um, five of these features, each one of which has six dodecahedra, so five times six is 30, so it's 30 cells of the 120 cell, so it's the 30 cell puzzle. Um, it's easier to see what's going on with the uh, toroidal half 120 cell. So I've uh, got a pipe cleaner in here which is showing uh, what's going on here and where, where this, this object comes from. So if you start in a, in a dodecahedral cell of this thing and choose a direction to go, so choose a face to, co to, to go out of, then, so if you, you, you go through this face, you're in another dodecahedral cell, and you can go straight through that guy out the opposite face and carry on. And it turns out that if you do this, you eventually come back around uh, to where you started after passing through uh, 10 dodecahedra. So there were, these, there were these chains of 10 dodecahedra that sort of go around like this. Um, and it turns out that uh, this guy, and then we can sort of see the fivefold symmetry here already, there's another... Uh, well, there's a total of five of these chains going around here. And uh, this, uh, this piece is part of one of these chains, and the five pieces are part of the five uh, chains that you see. So there's, there's six cells here, so all that's, that's happened there is that we've removed uh, the four largest cells. So remove these two, those are the two larger one, largest ones, and these two, and then the remainder, there are six uh, dodecahedral cells, and those are these, these six uh, pieces here. So that's where it comes from. It turns out that when you uh, print these out as Euclidean objects, they fit together um, to give you this object. And so here's the uh, solution to the reverse problem of turning this into five, five pieces. So here we go. It's not that hard to do. It's quite a bit more difficult to put them back together again. Uh, so there you go, the 30-cell puzzle.